final shoe for today is a move to zero Nike and it's really nice to see that Nike is going to start moving all of their shoes towards zero because they make so many shoes they have to do something to um, offset how many shoes they make and that's critical I know you guys are like dog we just here for the shoes we don't need a lecture I feel you we'll take these out because I actually really like these and if I'm a New Orleans Saints fan, I'm on it. But I love that also. You look like you can eat that. It's called pomegranate too. But that's all a recycled rubber compound. That same recycled leather compound is a rubber compound is on the toe box, on the Dubray. And then you have a cork, cork going up the back. And I'm going to go in here. Can't pull the insole out. It's glued down but there are recycled elements on the insole as well, but I can't pull it out. It's a Volt insole. Why is it Volt? I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with this very beautiful figure three pomegranate that's embroidered on the tongue. And I want to get the other shoe out. As a matter of fact, let me see if this has a stamp. It does. QC stamp, 01, 30, 21, 10. 01, 30, 21, 10. Um, dates of production 10, 14, 22, 01, 19, 21. That's less than uh, two weeks. Perfect. Stamp is right on point. Everything is on point. Um, swoosh is a bit canvas, kind of canvas. The side of the shoe is also canvas. This thing feels like it should be waterproof, but it's probably not. That leather is smooth. This Air Force One is really nice. Um, on the heel, this is why this is called the pomegranate. And I hadn't seen this until right now, and I've probably sold 30 of these. I'm just now seeing this because I hadn't done the video for it. And I hope you guys can see it. On the back of the shoe, it says pomegranate. I hope that gets into focus, right? But I'm going to read it. Pomegranate, scientific name, Punica granatium. Part of use, fruit rind, habitat, Korea, China. All right. So the pomegranate is a part of the construction of the shoe. So the outsole is actually pomegranate. Okay. All right. Okay, Nike. And that's why you have it on the tongue. I see you with the embroidery. I ain't mad at that, man. Um, this is the Air Force One 07 LV8 pomegranate. Makes perfect sense now. There's a white version of this. And I should have looked at it closely because it probably has the same stuff. And I didn't even pay attention to it. I feel like I screwed up. Uh, the color, black. Solar flare, white, black. SRP is only 110 um, uh, Man, the rhyme and reason behind the pricing on Nike shoes never makes sense to me. Never makes sense to me. Style code is CZ0338001. The uh, UPC, this is a size 7. This is a size 7. I still have this too, but I don't even know if I'll put it on the website because I don't sell anything on the website really. But, man, look at the bottom of that, yo. It's pomegranate. Kind of fresh. Uh, still going to give you the UPC. The 7 is a women's 8.5. 194955. What is that? 860373. 373, just double checking as always. And this is VO2, it's a small code, and it's made in Vietnam. Very nice shoe. Very nice shoe. Um, whenever I talk about Nike being successful, the Air Force One is a shoe that crosses every boundary as far as demographics women, men. Old heads, young dudes, you can make it fresh, you can make it look like a, just an old head, OG shoe, and they can wear the big baggy pants with these joints. It is, I say it all the time, the tongue is canvas. The design of this shoe is the perfect design for a shoe. You can't even elevate it any more than you can. I mean, as far as, well, you can elevate it by materials, of course. 
but every every brand should have a similar kind of shaped shoe, and they do, they do. So you know what? I put in the description a link to um, my top ten choices for alternatives to the Air Force One. Since I'm gloating all over Nike and they're not paying me, so I'll give you ten alternatives. So if you go down to the description, uh, there's going to be ten alternatives to the Air Force One in that list. And you know what? I'll update it with the premium list of five alternatives to the Air Force One. Nah, Nike, you don't pay me. I'm not going to sit up here and love on your shoe like that and not give somebody else love. I'm doing that. Sit. The pomegranate. And it actually tells you about it at the back of the shoe. I'm gloating again. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.